morning, it's time to rise and shine. Here we are at Changi Village Food Centre. Just look at the queue at the Nasi Lemak stall, which is present every day. This international Nasi Lemak stall is just one of the many renowned and critically acclaimed stalls in Changi. Another Nasi Lemak stall which is less well known is Mizzy's. While it does not have as long a queue, the Nasi Lemak here has been said to be as good as the international Indian food stalls. It's up to you to try both and decide. Other delicacies you may wish to try are the Ji Kui and the pineapple juice. Mmm, this is definitely a breakfast you won't forget. After that wonderful meal, it's time to work it off. You can take a leisurely stroll down to Changi Beach. For more adventurous, you can take a ferry from Changi Point Ferry Terminal to Pulau Ubin, the island home to Singapore's last traditional villages or kampongs for a day trip. The area is traditionally associated with the Eurasian and Peranakan community. Katong is a designated National Heritage Conservation Area with all these colourful traditional shop houses. You can also get a glimpse of the Nonya lifestyle through the daily dumpling, wrapping demonstration, heritage exhibitions and the Nonya boutique. Let's enter through the garden's signature Townland gates. Decorated with beautiful floral details, it's a masterpiece of its own. Nestled within the lush greenery of the gardens is the iconic Swan Lake with its beautiful sculpture of five swans. Another main attraction is the National Orchid Garden, which houses over 1,000 species of orchids. Flanking the landscape plaza is the Botanic Garden Shop, where you can stop by to buy some souvenirs for loved ones back at home. With the sun hanging high up in the sky, the down to culturally rich Chinatown for a visit to see the sights and sounds. Assemblance of Singapore's multicultural diversity will be a visit to Southbridge Road where Buddha Tooth Relic Temple, Jamei Mosque and the Sri Marinam Temple stand side by side. This scene is a perfect representation of Singapore's numerous racial groups in our multi-religious society. Hungry? Don't fret! Maxwell Road Food Centre is nearby to satisfy your cravings. showcases the best of Singapore in this lively and happening sheet market. Located in the heart of the city, it stands out as a chic and affordable bazaar. Over the years, it has attracted many dedicated followers, especially among the youth. Along the alleyways and streets, there are several food stalls which you can stop at for a quick fix, such as the juice stall and the chocolate fondue stall. As you taste the delicious food, let your feet travel around this gloomy market and shop to your heart's content. Dinner should naturally be the most exciting meal of the day, right? What better place to go to than to Glutton's Bay? Glutton's Bay is an alfresco dining place by the gorgeous Marina Bay skyline, an experience to remember. Celebrate the uniquely Singapore food paradise in her original form with all the noise, smells, sights and authentic flavours which never fail to attract foodies of all races. <coughs> the most famous foods at Glutton's Bay include the Roti John, the Orlo, the well-known satay and the Gado Gado salad. These rich culinary delights can be all nicely washed down with a chilled coconut drink to complete your perfect dinner. This is the very best place in the city to enjoy the spectacular panoramic view of Singapore's magnificent city skyline at the waterfront of the Marina Bay. 
As you stroll down the promenade along the Singapore River, be treated to the visual feast of Singapore's stunning night scene, the durian-shaped esplanade, Singapore flyer and the floating platform. You can also walk along the marvellous double helix bridge towards Marina Bay Sands. The Art Science Museum is in the distinctive lotus shape and also visit the Malayan Park. The magnificent waterfront trail along the Marina Bay is an unforgettable part of the Singapore skyline. Right across the street from Glutton's Bay, Marina Square houses Kenko Fish Spa, which exfoliates skin, promotes blood circulation and healthy glowing skin. You can visit this fish spa if time and finances permit. Satay Bee Hoon is an innovative dish where the chef blends elements from the Malay and Chinese cuisine together. The most critically acclaimed is the Hokkien Prawn Mee. Many flock to Chom Chom from all over the island just to taste this heavenly creation. Apart from having other delicious local cuisines, Chom Chom also houses some of the best desserts in town. After that wonderful meal, I'm sure you are all ready to go and all night to and continue exploring Singapore. For a night filled with loud music, lively dance moves and low lights, Cloud Key is definitely the place to go. Tonight we'll be exploring the clinic, a place just for you and your friends to chill with some drinks and have the time of your life. Come lean back and relax in wheelchairs while you enjoy your drinks through a syringe. The night is still young, so after grabbing a few drinks, you can also head down to Zerka for some fun, loud music and dancing. Presenting to you, Picture Perfect Singapore. Let's